Florida added nearly 9,000 cases in just one day. It brings the total number of positive results in Florida to more than 122,000 since the pandemic began. More than 1,800 of those new cases are from Central Florida. Orange County saw its biggest increase yet, over 1,000 cases reported in one day. Brevard, Osceola, Seminole, and Volusia counties all saw triple-digit increases. So we want to get right over to New 6 investigator Mike DeForest. And Mike, the governor does not seem too alarmed by these latest virus numbers. Well, Ginger, he's certainly urging Floridians to take precautions like wearing masks, practicing social distancing, but the governor expressed confidence that there is plenty of hospital bed space and protective equipment for medical workers should it be needed. What we're seeing, uh, you know, today, obviously a lot of news saying a huge number of quote cases. Um, really, nothing has changed in the past week. In terms Tonight, Governor Ron DeSantis is downplaying the latest rise in coronavirus infections, saying a majority of the new cases are young people under the age of 40 who are putting very little pressure on the state's hospitals. Most of these people are asymptomatic. Most of them, if they do have symptoms, will be so mild that they would not even need to seek medical attention. Uh, but uh, you are somebody that would potentially be able uh, to spread uh, the virus to more vulnerable groups. Today, as the White House Coronavirus Task Force held its first public appearance in weeks, Dr. Anthony Fauci urged Americans to help protect each other. You have an individual responsibility to yourself, but you have a societal responsibility because if we want to end this outbreak, really end it, and then hopefully when a vaccine comes and puts the nail in the coffin, we've got to realize that we are part of the process. Now, to help stop the spread of the virus, today the state of Florida banned the sale of alcohol in bars. You'll hear a lot more about that in just a few moments here. But other than that move, Governor DeSantis says he has no immediate plans to scale back Florida's reopening, no plans to implement new business regulations or mandate Floridians to wear masks. 